This calculation is one of the most important medical equations we do, especially in critical care. Let's talk about ideal body weight. It's not just a healthy weight for you. It's a calculation that helps us dose medications and set up life support machines like ventilators. Why? Well, because your vital organs, especially your lungs, have a predictable size based on your height, not your weight. If you're a 6'2", 300 pound person, your lungs aren't calculated based on the 300 pounds. They're calculated based on the 6'2 height. So we have to dose medications and ventilate based on that ideal size. To calculate a man's ideal body weight, we start with a base of 50 kilograms for the first five feet of height. To calculate a woman's ideal body weight, we start with a base of 45.5 kilograms for the first five feet of height. Then, for every inch over five feet, you're gonna add 2.3 kilograms to your equation for both men and women. Here's an example. So, if you're a 5'8 person, you are eight inches over five feet. For males, that would be 50 plus 2.3 times eight. For females, that would be 45.5 plus 2.3 times eight. This simple equation gives us a predictable weight to ensure we're delivering the right amount of medicine or the right volume of air to that patient's lungs. It's a way to standardize care and make sure that the person's size doesn't lead to dangerous miscalculations. So the next time you hear ideal body weight, remember that in medicine, it's a critical tool, not a judgment.